Going in for the ball was Hiwasa. And some midfield play, some adventurousness already as the Japanese break out through South. And on the outside, this could be the first try of the match. Yamada pulled down by Kurt Baker on the 22 metre line. Hiwasa again looking for ball runners. Ono. And Ono through a big fake. Murphy was ready. And they pick and drive up the middle immediately. Japan make a statement of intent of their own. Fifteen out. Now on the 22 middle line. Looking for the cut. Matsushima. Of the Suntory Club. And they will win the first penalty of the game, Japan. An interesting uh, decision here. They had guaranteed points. They go for the line out, Sumo. Taken down by Thompson. Tallest of the two locks on display for Japan. They get their driving more going, remembering they scored a penalty try from them all last week. And again, it pays dividends for them. We'll see what they do here because they have the option for the scrum also. And they were dominant in that area as well in the first test. They're going to go to the line out and back themselves again on the drive. And again, it's Thompson in the middle. Better counter drive this time from the Māori. And they look to wrap around on the open side. Ball is still live. Going into fight for it was Paul Wood. And he wins the penalty for the Māori All Blacks. Picked up and carried on by Hendrik Tui. Making some good metres up the middle of this Māori pack. Atakiyama was on the charge as they look for touch again. And will come back Angus Gardner. Another penalty. So Gurumaru. We'll look for touch. This is a good move too by the captain, Michael Leach, because he knows that New Zealand Māori can't pull it down. They have to stay up, otherwise someone's in the bin. So a lot of pressure on the Māori All Blacks right now. Kizu goes deep. It's Leach who takes it down at the back of the line -out. And he re-entered them all. In fact, not straight as the call from Angus Gardner. And a chance now for Hesketh. Khan Hesketh in the 14 jersey today. And another penalty. Very deliberate in his run-up. And the kick from in front. And it's away to the left. They've given up two penalties within throwing distance for that guy. And if they've missed the third opportunity, so that's nine given points. They probably could have had 